Okay, when you get your packet, you're gonna have three sets in them. The first piece of paper is going to be your objective. It's gonna tell you what you need to do to win the game and what each card represents. On the back of that are the rules, and it'll tell you how to play the game as well. Take that piece of paper, and you're gonna place it off to the side so that you can use it later. You're gonna have a pack of yellow cards. These are random event cards. You don't need these to win, but you need them if you get something wrong. So take these, place them up at the top, so they're out of the way until you need them. The pack of white cards, there's gonna be six of them. These are the ones you're going to do for each level or each round. Your object is to get them in chronological order from earliest time to the latest or more most modern. The first thing you do is you take all six of them, place them out in a random order, and without looking at the back, put them in the correct order that you believe they go in as a group. When you believe you have them in the correct order from earliest to latest, or BC to AD, flip all of your cards over at the same time. If any of them are in the wrong place, that is when you have to get a random event card. The random event card is played just like the white cards, only they have to be played in place as well. You have to get the random event cards correct before you can move on to the next round. When you think you've got them all correct, you'll raise your hand and we will come and give you a level up card. The level up card says several things. It tells you the name of your level first, and then it gives you a skill, something new that you get to use when you play. For instance, the level two skill is temporal paradox. Basically, it means if you got a card wrong, you can ignore the fact that you got it wrong and you don't have to take a random event card. Each skill can only be used once. You can't use it more than once. Take your level up card and place it over to the side until you use it. When you get your second set of cards, you're gonna do the exact same thing you did with the first set. Only these new cards have to go in the timeline with the other cards. Those are the old ones, these are the new ones. Same thing, after you place all of them, then you can flip them over, see if you got them correct. When you've gone through the round, just like you did the first time, and everything is where it's supposed to be, raise your hand and we'll come and give you the next set of cards.